writer, producer. I think I'm well known um, for the kink in my hair. The reason why I've chosen to do this campaign is because I truly do feel that it's important um, to discuss um, issues of um, queerness, gayness in the black community. I know that I believe that there's this um, untruth in the community about uh, people saying that the black community is not supportive um, of queer people and that has not been my experience I, I definitely feel that there's been challenges yes but I, I think that it's a community that needs dialogue I think it's a community that we we need to be open and, and be able to speak our truths and also know that maybe not everybody will walk out of the room agreeing but there's also definitely a level of respect um, I think for myself it's really important for me to be visible because I, I recognize that especially for a lot of queer youth that there is not a lot of role models out there there's not a lot of visibility and, and sometimes especially within our own um, coming out experience it can be a very isolating a very scary time and a very fearful time and I think um, I get I get tons of emails I get tons of requests daily from people um, especially youth who are talking about coming out and, and seeing me as a role model and so that is why I felt a need and an urgency to champion this campaign to say as a community we need to love and support and really hold our youth in a place of really safety and as family members it's really important for us to do that and family can exist outside of the realms of just biological family as a community we need to support one another and um, I will talk about really quickly the story about uh, I, I used to be very scared about coming out and I remember once I had this show and there was this little old woman who was sitting in the front row and she put up her hand and she said, she said, Trey, people are saying a lot of bad stuff about you and I just wanted to let you know. And I said, really? And she said, yes, because when you get to the top, people want to bring you down, right? And I said, what, what's the story? I said, what's going on? And she said, they're saying you're a gaze. Well, that's the truth and she went oh and she said well we love you anyways you're so funny we love watching you you're funny 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 she goes, I don't know about all of that gay stuff but you're funny and I thought that was the kind of acceptance that I needed that someone to just say to me as someone outside of my family to say it doesn't matter we love you and we are proud of you regardless and so I think if there's anything that comes from this campaign I hope that this happens.